What's up everybody? Welcome to the channel. Today we are doing Maria Becerra, Danny Ocean, No Eres Tu, Soy Jo. I wasn't you, it's me, it was me. Maybe she ate all the cookies. Finally we know the truth. Eh? I would be also very upset if I knew that I bought some nice cookies and I come home and they're not there anymore. Where are my cookies? Eh? It wasn't me. So is Jo. Now we know. Let's go. Wow, what a run. Space, but they don't like to decorate. You know, some people... It's fine. It's fine. Kind of a nice house. Okay. I mean, is it safe to say that this qualifies as a reggaeton? I mean, the rhythm, the, to me, they sound very similar to a ton of songs. Okay, fine. That's all right. That's what's working so far. Like very clean production, super produced, a lot of effect on the voice, which uh, it seems also nowadays, I've said this many times, but just for people to uh, to be clear, this type of autotune and effect on the voice, nowadays it's also not only a necessity for some people that they don't know how to sing, but a lot of times also for those that know how to sing, it's also just a stylistic choice because you expect this rhythm you expect that sound, people recognize the sound on the voice uh, on top of this sort of type of melody line, you know, the way they approach the metrics of the vocals, you know? You like sort of standing sleeping, it might be working, you don't know, maybe they found a new technique to rest quickly. In the rhythm, you know, this is really good stuff just in the club, you know, you do a remix or just like this and it just dance, you know, it wasn't you, it was me. Wasn't you, was me. Wasn't you, was me. Okay. The same thing, but sort of shifting the pitch, you know, like here you have the same thing, but really lower robotic voice, you know, just to uh, introduce some novelty in the repetitiveness of the... Come un iglu. So fria come un iglu. Jeff. Jeff. <laughs> Jeff. <laughs> I, I apologize, Jeff. They, Jeff, they're young. They don't know what they're doing. They don't know what they're saying, Jeff. Sorry, Jeff. <laughs> Sorry, Jeff. Sorry. All right. You know what? It's actually once you uh, kind of, you know, once you lower your expectations in the way that you just flow with the rhythm and uh, the sort of the novelty of the artist, for me at least, you know, it's a new artist for me, both of them. And uh, there is this kind of juvenile interaction, which is totally fine because after all, uh, yeah, that's how it is. That's what it is. Human dynamics, finding out stuff, talking about it, whether for vanity or for glamour or because you're trying to actually convey a message. It's all good in the, in, in the sort of immediacy of of this pop song you know like i said without expecting anything you just flow with it and kind of accept it you know i i don't uh, i i don't want to extrapolate nothing in particular out of this you know or even make it more than it's supposed to be which is a very entertaining well-produced polished uh, reggaeton song yeah But I would say like, you know, sometimes even in this type of contest, you can slit in some more interesting lyrics. Of course, I didn't grasp all the nuances of the language. And if there is any type of poetry that it's worth mentioning that I missed, you will be also uh, kind enough to point that out to me. Because of course, there might be a slight possibility you know what I mean? But anyway, like I said, don't expect much from it. Just enjoy the rhythm, the nice interaction. Actually, the guy with his higher voice reminded me a little bit of a goatee for some reason. Maybe also the type of look for uh, like the, that, that kind of indie look. Anyway, guys, let me know your thoughts. Huh? If you want to see more newer artists, let me know. Older artists, let me know. You want me to cover a song that I might be able to do? Let me know, we'll do that. And if you want to listen to my music, go on Spotify. Okay, the links are below. I'll see you there. Boom. Boom.